It's a revolution hosting the Chicago Fire here at Gillette Stadium. So glad you could join us. Darius Barnes, left back. It's very important for him to cover a lot of space behind Chris Tierney. He's called upon to be a lockdown defender. Sitting in behind him is Logan Foss. He's the anchor of the Chicago midfield. Look how he sits in front of the back four. It's very important for him to distribute for the, for the fire tonight. Shari Joseph, team's captain and leading scorer, anchors the midfield. It will be Chicago in red, over the ball set to kick off, moving from right to left, and we are underway. Down his keeper. Ayako does well. Nasri. A nice move by the Columbia, and he toe pokes it off to of the crossbar. Well, he had the game winner in stoppage time for Chicago last week against Columbus, and a strapping 20-year-old looks like he's got some moves out there. Look at that. What a cut. He cuts that on Korea. And really, you see Nasri, he's a big player. But look at this cut. Whoop! He gets right by, and Franco's not even in the picture anymore. And that doesn't miss by much. It hits the frame. But that's a big forward with soft feet. Very dangerous and very difficult to defend. Ford Mansali. Now he fulfills his coach's wish. Plays Nyasi delivery for Lekic. It reaches the day and he gets over it. Oh, punched away. That was on target. Great effort from Lekic and the Reds are still on the attack. Nyasi wastes the shot and he'll get uh, several teammates in his ear for that, including Captain Shari Joseph. But that was a good sequence for the rest. Excellent sequence, and it was nice that Coach was talking about. But good ball in from Nyasi. And look at Leggett's take it down. You see a good clash, but what a save from Sean Johnson. This is a great ball in, and you're going to see the clash from Leggett as he takes it down, gets his body over it, and a goalkeeper puts his hands up and makes a great save. Now Barnes. Third-year man out of Duke University for Alston. Heads it. Leggett shoots, oh, and goes just wide. And it was a save there. It will be a corner, so Leggett is knocking on the door, Jay. Great play. That was Kevin Olsen getting forward. Darius Barnes finds him. Watch how Kevin Olsen nods this down, and Leggett one time hits that, and look at that, the save from Sean Johnson. Leggett thinks he has his second goal. Very difficult to, to, to get by a goal. A.J. Soares is down. Now he's back to his feet, but appears shaken up. Oh, look at that. Shot there by Nyako and a good save from Reese. The chances of both ends. Keep an eye on AJ Soares, who's down again after coming together with the Nazri. Look at this play from Nyako, just over Kevin Olsen, and that's some class. And Matt Reese up to the challenge. We spoke with Matt Reese before the game, talking about how good he is at making that save when his team needs him. Bump there on Nyasi. He kept his feet well, but. Nyako digs it out and plays it into space for Oduro. One on one, going at Barnes. Weaving, shooting, and scoring. 1-0 Chicago. What a run by Oduro, who put the finishing touches on it with a side foot shot to give the visitors the lead. Well, that shows you his blistering pace. And it, it was Nyako winning that ball and springing Oduro down the flank. And he just kept going. Look at this. This is a good hustle play from Nyako. Nothing Nyasi can do. They're fighting for it. They're both going for it. And Nyako has the presence of mind, springs Odoro, and now is he, Darius Barnes is sitting duck with the kind of speed that Odoro has. And he just slots it, side foots it. Good finish from the from the Ghanaian. Look at this ball back post, and it actually deflects off of Darius Barnes. Attacking chances for him. Well, I mean, what you saw there, I think, is is really good. You know, when I mean, we win the ball in the middle of the field like that, uh, you know, the defense is always, you know, unaware of the of the forwards running. And uh, oh, Lekic, yeah, the flag stays down, and Lekic has the second goal. <laughs> we all let that go because we thought he was going to be offside, and that's what everybody in a red shirt is saying. Silvio Petrescu, the referee, but the goal stands, there's no turning back now, and the New England Revolution are back on level terms today. Excellent player, because this is very good from Lekic. I think he's actually onside, because as this ball comes up, look at there's a player there, and as this comes off Balin's foot, yes, a defender was slow coming up, it just reacted, he was going one way and the other, and a good finish from Lekic. Pat Balin just lets this fly, and Lekic does a nice job opening his hips and beating Sean Johnson that far side. Dangerous fall down, and now it's a corner kick. Terry to the near post. Oh, that was off the near post. It was AJ Soares getting across the front of his man and nearly turning on to the frame of goal. Across the six yard box. Pat Phelan, as a midfielder, covering the forward. Kusic serves it in. Oh, the header cleared off the line. The new guy comes through big time. It's still alive. 
and it's over. Well, Matt Reese is livid, but Shawry Joseph has a kind word for the new player, Ryan Guy. Makes a goal-saving play. Dominic Aduro can't believe he didn't score. Well, yeah, look at this play. Look at this. Ryan Guy, excellent position on the back post and times it perfectly because there was a lot of head on that. That was Bruce, and it, it was just going to go to the goal there. Oh, my goodness. Great save from Ryan Guy. And then there's the play continuing, and it was a good block from A.J. Soares. And look at A.J. Soares. Joseph layoff. Didn't find teammate. Here comes Daniel Caldini. Bruce. Left-footed strike and a great save by Matt Reese. He's been tested a couple times in the last few minutes, and it was Palladini from outside the area this time. Great build-up, and maybe I should take what I back what I said about Palladini as an offensive threat. He really is. He just broke down the Revolution defense. Yes. Barnes with the long throw, last gasp for the Revs. Lekic gets it down, tries to turn, juggling act, strikes it just wide. What a bid by Lekic, but he couldn't put it on target. Wow. What an effort. Juggles once, juggles twice, and he hits a left foot streaming by the post. Good effort. Wow, that would have been an excellent goal and stop his time. Well, if there's a positive the Reds can take away from what's now a draw, it's perhaps that Lekic has gotten on track. Jay, the Reds wanted six points from this homestand in two games. They're going to have to settle for two. Uh, can you summarize the, the, the last uh, four days for the Revolution? Are things headed in the right direction? Well, I mean, if you're talking about the Toronto match to this match, it was night and day. The Revolution actually had an absolute game plan. They came out and they showed some offensive flair. They did a lot of good things, but just not enough in the end. But you want to see Lackage get on track like he did, scoring a goal. Good things for the Revs. Have to build on it.